Back to the grind, I'm back. Look at her. Matua check. Fishing, man. We're going fishing? Going no. There they are. What'd you say? I said they'd love to see me. So while I was gone. Good times. y'all back back to the grind i'm back i'm back 10 out of 12 days gone i'm back went to florida had a great 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 visit with family celebrating my uncle's life and getting to see family i hadn't seen in 8 10 12 years it was good it was really good so um anyway that's done and now we're going now we're going to put out some minerals. It's beautiful. It's in the 50s. Um, sun shining. <sighs> I was tired. I was actually taking a little tiny little nap watching the riflemen. But <laughs> I'm gonna get I'm gonna get going now. Hey Rusty, hey Reba. Here they come. Hello. How's it going? Check. He said it's looking better every warm day. It's coming up. So I'd asked him about maturity on that, and he's saying mid April, 1st of May to cut, first cutting. How many cuttings do you think it'll get? What? How many cuttings? It depends on how much it rings. Oh, how much nitrogen and fertilizer? Enough fertilizer, nitrogen, get enough rain to cut it four times. Enough enough of everything four times but hopefully at least three okay that's gonna be interesting to see what we get then when will the barley be ready june, june. oh june okay june we just what are we doing just checking out the pond we're fishing man we're going fishing no i haven't I didn't know that's what we were doing. I didn't bring my rod. Right. I'm not holding my mouth right. I'm not holding my rod either. Oh, you moved the cows. They moved the cows over here. I didn't realize they moved them. Leave it down, I don't know where we were going. Leave it over here. There's the other farm. I love this part. I love this right here. It'd be a beautiful place for the house. It's just not a good road. It's not a good road to it. Oh, 
We're on a little incline here. And a big limb broke off of this tree. Oh, let me get this somehow. <laughs> Girls are not in here. He so said he left the gate open, so it might be on this side, they might be on the other side. But I bet we're gonna go try to find them. There they are on the river bottom. I think he said that's where they probably were. They ain't fed to them on the only too damn hay though. Mm, but I think but they're they pretty happy. Grass. They got grass. They ain't in no mud standing there. They're happy. Either. They're not. I don't think they look bad by any means. <laughs> I wonder. Look at her looking at you. Hey, say, baby. <laughs> bunch of dust coming out up there. He says it's from where the river got out and it left all the mud. Oh no, they're hollering. Y'all got it made. I don't want to hear it. What'd you say? I said they love to see me. That's why they're hollering. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm sure that's it. It is. It is. Okay. <laughs> holler back at them and they'll follow me today. I know they'll back. follow you. That's why I was afraid they were going to start coming. Well, they're going to get mellow. <laughs> the breeze going to be all right. You don't see as much out there where the grass was thick, but it's out yeah. there. It just ain't showing through the thick grass. <laughs> okay, that's done. Oil change. Oil change needed. I know. We got to order all the stuff to get the oil change, y'all. Mark said all the truck, everything needs its oil change. So that's, that's going to be fun. Where's the trailer? Oh, the trailer's down there. Oh, so while I was gone, the kids had a jackpot yesterday. It's the first one I've missed, but, um, they did really good. Uh, Wesley placed first on the team in the cattle drive. Austin was on the second and third team, and then Wesley got first in the roping. So they did really good. Um, I hate to miss it, but it was good. I'm glad they did good. So he's taking them up here. He just dropped them off. They're gonna bring Rip and Hank in while I go do this. Then we'll find something for supper. <clears throat> There's my rippy boy. Oh, sorry. Whoops. I'll show that. Sorry. No privacy, huh? Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. You got a week off for sure. We got to get back in, back in action, back on track. Hank is not even thinking about coming. He's not even thinking about it. We have to ride Rip over there and get him. Oh, it's almost five o'clock, y'all. I don't like going to the store at five o'clock, but it is what it is. At least I did a pickup. Who else loves grocery pickup? I love grocery pickup. Because I do not love grocery shopping. So it works great. Here's Bonnie. Here's Bonnie. Duke is outside in his little cage and he's not happy. He's barking right now. Um, okay, groceries. So while I was gone, the new black refrigerator was installed. I'll show you a before of the, um, the freezer. This is an after. Y'all, it was busting at the seams. I feel like I got it somewhat under control. It's going to take some getting used to. It's going to take some getting used to having to bend all the way down to get the things. Anyway, here we are. And I found these things on Amazon, and I'm loving them. They are magnetic shelves, and they are, like, very secure. So I put, like, my most used seasonings, other than, of course, my, my um, musket powder and K-Fred. 
and this is a season in that I love, I don't, I don't sell it, <laughs> but I buy it from Amazon, Santa Maria. Um, so anyway, I'm like my sprays and olive oil and stuff. And then I got a new bar that will not move. It, it will not move. It's magnetic for my knives. Because, you know, storage is just, it's a thing here. It's, it's a thing we don't have. So we have to be creative. So anyway, there's that. That's, um, that was my two hour project when I got home after I drove 10 hours yesterday. <laughs> but it's done and I'm feeling good about it. Now to finish filling it up more. We got more groceries to get, Bonnie. You gonna help me? I wish you could. Okay, so now the the million dollar question is how long will this refrigerator stay on our porch? We go from Okay, Duke, we go from mattresses to like chairs and I don't know what that's a refrigerator. We'll let you out in a minute. They were doing something with a tractor going back and forth. I guess they're putting out hay. So they put him up so he would not get run over. That's why he's in the pen. And that's why he's not happy. Okay. Now the kids are going to um, feed seven. So also while I was gone, so much has happened, right? While I was gone, seven drank his last bottle of milk and he's now over at the corral where he can get, um, where he can have more room. He can get under the barn, and then he's out in this other area. Um, so they're having to feed him grain. Okay, so he's getting grain and hay, of course. And he's got clean, fresh water all the time over there. So um, I can't remember if she said they cleaned the stall out. I don't think they cleaned the stall out yet. So that's got to get done this week. But they're both very happy about graduating from bottle to just feed and not having him in the stall. <laughs> I'm glad for him to be out of the stall, too. Um so, but we just, we just went by there when we were putting out minerals and he was hollering. Um, Lawrence said anytime he sees Lauren, Wesley, he starts hollering. So he's being weaned from the bottle and he's not super happy about that. He misses his bottle, but that's life, right? That's life. Um, we can't stay on the bottle forever, y'all. Okay, my meat is thawed out. That's good. Cute steak tonight. Easy peasy. All right, here we are. It's breakfast time. Hey, Hanky. <laughs> they did get um, seven stall cleaned out. So that's nice to have, we need it. And Rips needs completely stripping. He's just happy, <laughs> he's just happy to have his breakfast. <laughs> How much do you love your food, Han Rip? So much, Mommy, so much. Good morning, sunshine. Good morning. How are, how are you? Good. <laughs> Thank you for holding the fort down. <sighs> Keeping the horses up. Appreciate you. <laughs> all right, pasture bound. Well, he took off one way and now he's back. <laughs> what are you doing, Rip? What are you doing? Feeling good. Thank you for not chasing them. I really, I really want to go there. see if I can bring them, bring them somewhere. Hey, <laughs> Okay, now it's, what's the matter? Why are you putting that up? I don't know why it was up. Okay. Feed, calf feed, I'm gonna see seven. Bonnie would not go inside because she would not leave her mommy. <laughs> so Bonnie gets to go. Good morning, Seven. Look at you in your new little home. Isn't this sweet? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hey, sugar. I don't have any milk. Oh, you're stepping on me. Don't step on me. Get your food. I want to find some milk somewhere. No, it's not on my bibs, I promise. Seven. Seven. Somebody's got to have a bottle of milk around here somewhere. There you go. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs>
that's good. He's eating eating better then, isn't he? Mm -hmm. Yeah. He wasn't he wasn't really happy about not getting his bottle, but now he's learning that that right there <laughs> is his new bottle. <laughs> I haven't even been paying attention and I know these have been in bloom for a while now because they always start early but my hellebore oh my gosh these right here look so pretty wow I think I don't think that was a new plant it looks like a lot of new growth there and I transplanted some I transplanted all these over here it looks like they're doing okay they still need to fill in some but anyway they're also called Linton Rose, Linton Rose, L-E-N-T-E-N. -E they're like the first thing to, they bloom in the winter. And I love them so much. And we also have a really good crop of, um, I want to call this henbit. I think it's henbit and, oh, it's failing me. It's not coming to me. Weeds, y'all, weeds. The weeds are coming on strong. And I guess it's probably time for me to throw the, um, <laughs> throw the fur and the berries, the Nandina away, y'all, you think? But then there's this part of me that doesn't want these to be just completely empty. I'd rather have something dead in them than nothing at all. And I put ferns here, and it's a little bit yet before we get ferns. But anyway, trash anybody? It, it made it out the door, but it hasn't made it to the truck. Okay. Let's go tackle the day. Okay, y'all, it is a beef and broccoli kind of night here because we gotta get out the door fast for church. Man, it's a lot of water in there. Kids are bringing the horses in. It looks like they're acting up a little bit. Or I don't know what's going on. They're riding bareback on both of them. Got halters, you know, just doing their thing. Um. Anyway, it's been a good day, y'all. Just trying to get back in the groove. So we leave early tomorrow morning and take three calves to the, what do you want to call it? The butcher, processor, meat processor, ar arbitor, ar ar what's that word? Anyway, that's what we're doing. So we're going to start getting the meat processed, uh, let it hang for a couple weeks, and then um we're going to take three at a time. I think we're doing about 12 this year. we got to add all that up. Anyway, tis, tis the season, and I'll be glad to get some hamburger, y'all. Oh, my gosh. I miss my hamburger so much. What do we, we got, like, we got some big hair going on here, don't we? Okay. I have to feel like I have to address it because I've actually got my hair fixed. Because I washed it, because I need washing. So, I'm going to a farm beer meeting, and I thought it would be nice to show up with not really greasy hair and a ball cap. So, um, I tried a little, I tried a little, tried a little styling stuff to get a little volume. I don't know. Verdict's out. Huh, I got some hair. Got some big hair. Okay. Supper. Okay, y'all, here we go. First three getting ready to get on the trailer. I'm only two, two and a half weeks away from having hamburger again. <laughs> so excited. Oh, me. It's always bittersweet, of course. It's bittersweet to see them go, but this is what we do. And I'm thankful thankful for them and for for the people that, that purchase meat from us. Oh, yeah, it's open. All right. My job is the gate. Allison's tucked. We're in, we're in Lawrence's Dodge, so she has to be behind the seat, and it's hard to get in and out because he had it hooked up. From when I was out of town, he had to take that for the jackpot to take the horses. So anyway, it was still hooked up. So we're going old school today, y'all. We're going old school. Four humans and a dog. Duke's with us. So good times <laughs> this morning, early morning. All right, here they come. One, two, three. Okay, how easy was that? How easy was that? All right, that's easy peasy. Let's cut the lights off. Nope, just kidding, not them. 
that way. Bouncing on down the road. Hello, Duke. What you doing back there, Duke? Whew. What are we doing? Uh, what time is it? I don't know. 7.30. Okay. It's done. Hamburgers on the way. Woohoo! What do you think, Duke? I don't know, man. How are you doing back there, sis? Snug as a bug in a rug. Snug as a bug in the back of a ram. They call these rams even back then, right? Still called a ram? Oh, it's a dot. Goat. It's a goat. It is a goat. It's a red goat. Okay, we're getting a little slap happy here. Slap happy. We're tired. Well, yeah, because we got up so early. I mean, I woke up at 4.30 and I never went back to sleep. That's a problem. Anyway, we're now at the local co-op waiting on a hay ring that was supposedly already here, but it's not and it's on the way. So, we're just going to wait. We need a horse ring because I'll show you cowboy is like losing his mane where it's been rubbing so this one's specifically made for horses so anyway duke is duke, <laughs> duke is getting up duke is <laughs> what is he doing to you dukey what is he doing to you You're like a little old lady little lady duke <laughs> oh and we're hungry and i've only had one cup of coffee i like my cape red cup um so yeah. Just hurrying up and waiting, aren't we, Duke? Yes, that's what we're doing. I've got so many Duke licks. So many Duke licks this morning. What's she doing to you back there? Mm -hmm. What do you think, Hank? You ready to go out? Rip, are you almost done? Are you almost done? Okay. Have a good day. Why are you pawing? Oh, whoa! <laughs> what was that? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Rocket. <laughs> he is really feeling it. Oh, man, he's feeling it. Rocket, what was that? Rocket's like, I'm just going to lay low. <laughs> Come here, Rock. Rocket. Come here, Rocket. Rocket. Come here, buddy. <laughs> nope, I'm just going to go over here. He's got the border collie stance going on. We waited 45 minutes for that truck to get there, and it never showed up. So, they're supposed to be bringing it out to us later. So, I'll show you that. Hey, Ring. Um... We, we had one choice. <laughs> All three farm stores in our, within the, an hour radius of here only had one, one kind. So the tartar horse hay ring it is. Here's hoping. Lawrence is afraid that it's not going to be very substantial. Like, uh, it's not cheap though. It's $500, y'all. So I'm like, I sure hope that thing lasts. I hope they don't tear it up. I guess we'll find out. We'll let you know how that goes. Oh, another beautiful day. The sun's just really bright. I can't remember if I've ever showed this on here. I know I have on Instagram. It's a frittata. And if I'm gonna eat like brunch, I really like this because I don't always want veggies first thing in the morning, <laughs> but um, it's like almost lunchtime. So um, what I do is I just sauteed some mini peppers and some spinach and um, cut up some cherry tomatoes and then I pour egg I will mine's an egg and some egg whites on top of it and let this set up on the bottom a little bit and then I will put it in the oven and let it broil and cook the top and um, oh and I, obviously I just dumped some shredded carrots too put a little season a little salt so good oh I forgot my cake bread okay now we're good easy this is. Okay, here it is, y'all. I have made much prettier ones. This one is not as pretty. 
but it's still pretty. I think they're fancy looking. I think it's like something you would get at a, like a restaurant or something. Okay, this is what we're doing. Yeah, and here we have it. Here we have it, here we have it. Oh, I thought it was a tartar, it's a Balin. Okay, I said that wrong. It's gray, gray. Did you just clean that out? Gosh. Huh? It cleaned itself? I know it did. Good job. Kids have been doing school. We've been doing school together. <laughs> the day is about gone. Oh my gosh. And I wanted to be outside. It's so pretty. Oh well. That's it. We're going to wrap this day up because the day is about to wrap itself up. Um yeah <sighs> tomorrow maybe we'll get to ride tomorrow it's a good bowl anyway all right i hope this finds y'all well i don't even know exactly what we've had on here a little of this and a little of that but i'm glad to be home i'm glad to be getting back in the swing of things probably take me a, it's taking me about a week <laughs> to get to get kind of straight again but i'm home now for two weeks and then I go to Michigan. Never been to Michigan. I'm going to Michigan to speak at a women's conference. And then I'm home until April. <laughs> and then the river's calling. And and it's going to be planting. And then before we know it, we'll be harvesting barley. And we'll be cutting hay. And spring is almost here, y'all. It's almost here. 